Hey fellow budgeters, welcome back to my channel. I am a cash stuffer who lives in Australia and October is seriously the best month for me because well it's my birthday month. So in America I know that the, the Halloween season is super super big um, but in Australia it's kind of not there yet um, at that kind of level. However, I want to join in the fun, so I've put my Halloween style nails um, in for this video. <laughs> I hope you guys like it. It is Batman, so yeah. Um, so because it is the new month, and we, I've noticed that I'm starting to have a system in the system of cash stuffing, which is trying to prioritize something for one month and that is what I'm going to do in October. I'm going to prioritize my short-term binder and some of my long-term binder that I still need to put a golden heart to. Um, and the biggest priorities for me, if you did watch my target expense video, which I'll leave a link up above for those who haven't, I want to complete that as soon as possible so I will be stuffing the target bill envelope as much as I can um, because I want to get that done and completed and I don't want to think about it so that are the priorities for October um, and yeah let's get cash stuffing our first week of October Okay, starting off with my wallet, and you guys know that I never have left over um, because I do budget for the exact amount. So Food Shop will be getting $150, and that is, I, I just needed to decrease it again because I did budget $170. 51, 20, 40, 50. And we were just using $170 because we had $172 for that um, category. So I'm definitely not going to do that again. <laughs> so I'm going to decrease it back to $150 because we were doing so good with this amount. So $150 for food shop. Fuel will be getting $60 and this is me and my partner's uh, week of fuel for us. Takeout will be getting $50. So we are done stuffing our wallet and that's just the card holders and my receipt. Okay so on to our bill expense binder. So we will be stuffing in pipeline $150. So it will be getting two fifties, two twenties, and a ten. So a hundred and fifty. We'll put that together. Okay. So pipeline now has. 51, 52, 50, 70, 90, 310, 30, 50, 70, 80, 90, 400, 510. dollars in pipeline. All these bills are already paid. 
household will be getting five dollars and household now has 10 25 35 45 Luna will be getting five dollars and Luna now has 10 5 20 and I did have to change some of her fives because I needed fives <laughs> so Luna is done and we are done stuffing our bill expense binder okay so on to challenge um, envelope we will be stuffing two tens one two six twenties one two three four five six three fifties one two three and a hundred so all together we will be stuffing 150, 250, 70, 90, 310, 30, 50, 70, 80, 90. So 390 we will be stuffing in our challenge envelope. Which is a great amount to stuff because I look at my challenges as my savings. So yeah. Okay, so on to my short term binder. And we will be stuffing in birthdays $60. I have nothing here because I did give the boys the $200 that I budgeted. And if you guys want to know, um, I did receive a birthday gift from them, which was a coffee machine, which I really, really wanted. So I'm super, super, super happy that I'm able to get that from them. So now we're going to stuff for two of my family members' birthday coming up. So $60 will be added to birthdays. And then family time, we will be stuffing $20. I did use some um, over the school holidays. So 30 now, and that was much, that was needed. I needed that money to just relieve some of the pressure of keeping sane. <laughs> for all those mums out there <laughs> we need time um dates not gonna get anything and events will be getting fifty dollars um and this is for my birthday dinner that's coming up um so events now has fifty one fifty two Health will be getting $20. So health now has 20, 40, 65. Holidays will be getting $25. So 20 and a 5. Let's put that together. So health holidays now have 150, 70, 90, 210, 520. So 220. And we are done stuffing our short-term binder. Okay, so on to the long-term binder. Starting off with Christmas, we will be putting in a hundred dollars, and this will complete the 
envelope. So 100. So now Christmas has 1,000. 1, 50, 2, 50, 3, 50, 4, 50, 70, 90, 500. So 1,500 in Christmas. And we have completed it. I'm so happy. This is super exciting because now I don't need to stuff it. And we will put a gold laugh heart on this envelope. So yeah, I'm so happy and just relieved. <laughs> it's taken a while to reach that amount. Trust me, I think I've stuffed it from day dot. So yeah, it's definitely exciting and I cannot wait to do a cash condensing video so I can put this into the bank and have it ready for whatever deals happen. I think there's like Cyber Mondays or something like that online um, before Christmas so I can get some of the presents um, on a steal. So Grandmama will be getting $50. So she now has one fifty two fifty three twenty forty sixty eighty ninety five four hundred so four hundred dollars for grandmama power and water which is one of the focus priority envelope that I want to be doing so it is getting $25, so 25 So Power and Water now has 51, 50, 70, 90, $205. Rates will be getting nothing today. Target bills will be getting $100. Oh, 51. So 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 50. 60, 70. So 770. Now, what I'm doing to keep on track, I've just made it as like a challenge um, where I will tick it each week and I have a set amount that I need to put into this envelope. Um, to reach my goals so yeah it just helps me mentally to keep on track with my target bills and to make sure that I put money into it because if I treat it like it's leftover or like I know the last um, bills envelope to be um, stuffed then yeah I won't have any money towards it so with Jim, I will be putting in 25 and this is also one of my envelopes that I will be um, focusing as well as I need to reach a thousand dollars by the start of next year. So Jim now has 51, 20, 40, 50, 60, 75. So $175. Home will be getting, no, sorry, no tires. Tires is completed. That's why it has a gold heart. Home will be getting $100. Now, 
I'm going to count this money right here. So home has 110 and it will be receiving a hundred dollars. So two fifties. And the reason why I'm doing this is because I have a binder specifically for moving and to get my house to get the house ready for um, selling. So what I've done is I've just went through with my partner to see what we need to, you know, focus on fixing. Um, I haven't written anything yet, but this envelope is for lights. So all the light bulbs need to be changed. The windows need to be cleaned. Um, anything to do with the outside and that is including the garden, the gate and the garage. Um, the doors need to be changed and the bathroom needs uh, renovation. So this is this binder is specifically for moving out and I will put just a hundred dollars into the light envelope I have um, I have a budget amount on top of the tracker um, and this is just an estimate and just keep in mind this is just half because it's half his half his dad so his dad would need to put half and this is just the amount that we're going to budget for. So lights has a hundred dollars now and I will be stuffing this quite um, consistently because it is one of my priorities for this year and next year. So you'll see a lot of this binder and the more you know, as time goes by and if I need to fix things, I'll add an envelope for it and yeah, we'll budget for it. So yeah, I'll put that to the side. So we are done stuffing. Uni fees is not getting anything. So yeah, we are done stuffing my long-term binder. Okay, so on to my son's binder. So Baba will be getting eighty dollars. So fifty, seventy, eighty. Um, let's put that together. Okay. So Baba now has. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 50, 7, 58, 50, 70, 90, 910. Wow. He, he honestly went, <laughs> he was playing with his binder and he went through his money again. So that is why the money is all. Yeah. So $910 for my Baba. He's so adorable. I cannot believe we are nearly there to giving him a 1K slip. His birthday will be getting $20. So his birthday now has... 51, 20, 30, 130. School will be getting five dollars. So school now has ten, twenty five, thirty five, forty.
his clothes or wear will be getting ten dollars and he currently has nothing in there so ten dollars Sports has nothing, no, hang on, wait. Sports has something in there. <laughs> it's behind. So sports will get $20. So sports now has Brain will be getting five dollars, and this is to do with anything he educational. So fifteen. So books, um, any utensils he's using or material to learn, like clocks and stuff that he's learning for time. Toys will be getting ten dollars. So toys now have twenty. Party will be getting 55 and it has nothing in here. So 55. And this is to do with any invites that he gets from his schoolmates or anybody else that we know. And this will cover for like the birthday card, the birthday gift and the gift wrapping. And it does add up. Um, and his body, so anything to do with him, so $10. So we are done stuffing his binder and we have completed stuffing this week, the first week of October. Thank you so much for joining me in today's video. Okay, so the magic phrase is going to be a bit different this month because it is my birthday month and I want to change it up a little bit. So for those who watched my challenge video, it is a value of $2 now. And it is all going to be around finishing the sentence and to keep it um, with the answers, to keep it a little bit small, we're just going to be, it's going to be about your finance and pretty much you, yourself. So let me start off. So week one is I wish and I wish I was on this cash stuffing system earlier than this year because if I was doing it last year when the COVID happened I would be on like just an amazing train ride to <laughs> to pretty much paying off my bills um, and being ahead so yeah I wish I was on the cash envelope system a bit sooner now it is your turn and I cannot wait to read them all thank you so much for joining me and I wish you guys a lovely day bye now